Hello, I created this video with the um, purpose of helping those people that pass through the same as I did. So um, I was with Candida for a couple of years and, you know, go, comes and goes and never took really seriously the diet. So uh, I got sick with infection and I got prescribed antibiotics and in the past as well. So in my case is abuse of antibiotics. Doctors prescribe antibiotics for everything. So I study uh, Ayurveda and a little bit of natural medicine in India. So I say, okay, I'm gonna decide to heal myself instead of going again to the doctor and taking more chemicals into my body. So I start doing the candida cleansing and I start drinking, as you can see I have a lot of um, creams and things over here. So I start taking bentonite clay for um, cleansing my body in the morning uh, uh, with water and um, so I start attacking at the beginning the, 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 the candida and I realized I was getting a lot of rashes everywhere and I'm going to show you this is a picture of, a, of me with a rash and it was pretty bad. It looks like I was scratching myself and I have this rash all over and all over my body so I decided and I realized the rush came after eating peanuts or one time I ate a egg and I said yeah but the candida diet you can eat egg that's weird that's when I start thinking there is something else so I start searching more and I say okay I have leaky gut syndrome because I, I was taking also probiotics and I was getting the rash. Even just drinking water, I was getting rash all over. And the rash is super uncomfortable. It's itchy, it gets swollen, it's itchy all over my body. It's uh, disgusting, it's painful. And um, I so I start doing, of course, the, the diet of cleansing only eating, eating vegetables and um, a little bit of meat but mostly vegetables and it's very hard I know for for you guys out there it's very hard to go to a social meeting and only eat vegetables and sometimes you know we think it's boring but it's for our good health so I try to stick to a strict diet because I say okay it's more painful to be with the allergy than to do a diet. So I was, I bought a lot of things. I bought magnesium for relaxation before I sleep. I did gargle of um, colloidal silver. Also, I was recommending in the natural store to alkaline my water. It could be mixed with a little bit of lemon and a little bit of teaspoon of this to alkaline the water so I was trying all of these and at the beginning I still with the rush and it wasn't going away so the, uh, so uh, I went to the natural store to, uh, to buy a slippery elm and I saw this magazine and it says do you have leaky gut and I say, oh my God, let me give it a read because to see if I can find something that I can, you know, help me heal. So when I read it, it says uh, something here. It says that we can buy a mix. It's a powder that have BNC Nature's Health. It's cold, but anything, anything that have curcumin, glutamine, aloe vera, glucosamine, slippery air, quercetin, especially. So I decided to buy 
It's a little expensive, but it's worth it. This one cost me here in Australia $88. But it has glutamine, 2,500 milligrams. And this is gut relief, is 400 grams. I recommend you buying a big quantity because so you can use it, it can last a long time. And um, so it, it tastes pretty good because it's with stevia, which is a natural sweeter. And I do a spoon in the morning with every meal. And it really was like a miracle. Instead of buying, you know, so many products separate, each one by one by one, it's nice because you have everything together. And so I've been using it and I noticed two weeks, my rashes are gone today. This is the morning that I wake up, I ate, and I have a drink, and, and nothing happened. It was all good. Nothing happened with me. So now I'm going to continue. Uh, I'm going to start continue drinking this for maybe like a, one more week I'm planning. And after that, after that, no. Um, after the, the week, I'm going to start doing the cleansing diet. So I'm not taking any probiotics right now because I'm healing and concentrating in healing my gut first. And after that, I'm going to, after I cleanse uh, or heal the gut, then I'm going to start rebuilding, which is doing the probiotics. So which are probiotics I am using... I am using in the powder, I'm using inner health, but everybody can use a, a, any probiotics they like. A lot of people have, I read, I'll have a lot of comments that this one is better, the other one is better. I like this one because it comes in, a, in, in powder and very, I would say, big quantity, so you can put it in a teaspoons with your green veggies and smoothies. Also, I am... Um, it's very good to drink bone broth and I was drinking soup, this soup um, every single day almost I was preparing here at home and also it's very good to use um, multivitamin vitamin C and um, I was taking garlic and horseradish and believe me, I, I go to parties, I, this, I didn't want to stop, I'm a social person, I love friends, and I didn't want to stay at home all the time. So it was very hard for me because I went to parties Friday and Saturday, and I have to see all these people eating like fontan of chocolates and strawberries and <laughs> all this delicious food that I couldn't eat, but then, you know, I focus on healing and my health and and I was thinking okay <clears throat> focus on healing because then you can once you heal you can enjoy this food a little bit but if you don't heal then you gonna or every time you eat every time you eat something you don't like uh, sorry something you're not supposed to eat then you go back on your diet so sorry <laughs> I I hope I I hope I help you. I have to go. But if you have any questions, um, uh, let me know. It's very good to exercise every morning or or when you can. At least walking is excellent. Uh, you know you have to think your health is first. So try to relax, exercise, put music in the house. Um, and um, also, with every meal, I, I drink digestive. It's very good to help your, your stomach to digest the foods with every meal. So basically, my meals were soup of bone broth. And then I will prepare like a salad. And, um, and then try to stick with it until you feel better. It, even if it's hard, drink... You know, you can, when you feel like a snacking, get um, chamomile tea 
or or a smoothie that you can prepare at home maybe with an unsweetened almond meal and a spinach and um and um can put <laughs> carrots if you want or or leek okay thank you very much um i know I read a lot and everybody have a, a try this and I try that and and you know the body is different for everyone so this is what I try so you can experiment with your own adding your own natural products as well and other things but in general I wanted to you know recommend this one that it helped me and um, Again, it has aloe vera, glutamine, quercetin. Okay, thank you very much. I can write down above the, the name for you to understand.